Hey Scorpio, <clears throat> welcome to your bonus love reading for your rest of your September 2024. You can apply this to your sun, moon, rising, Venus signs. So we are going to take a look and see what is going to get on, what is going on with you guys in love and the person that you are connecting with. And then we will take a look at your person to see what their true feelings and intentions are towards you. And then we'll finish off the read to see what else you guys need to know, look out for, work on, apply this to your own unique, unique situations. You may switch the roles if you want. Uh, like, share, comment, subscribe. Hit the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post when I go live. Also, if you guys are interested in following me on TikTok, Instagram, my other YouTube channel that's dedicated solely to my travels, the links for those are in the description box below. Support me on there too. Um, anyone interested in booking a personal reading with me, the link for that is also in the description box below. So tell me about Scorpio. What's going on with Scorpio and love and the person that they are connecting with for the... Oh, uh, for the rest of their September 2024, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for Scorpio. So we have the Nine of Swords, stress and anxiety here, and sleepless nights you're dealing with here when it comes to this connection that you're dealing with here. All right, with the King of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy, and also we have the Queen of Swords. Yeah, between you and your person here, Scorpio, you guys are not communicating here. Someone here is very emotionally closed off. Some of you is very mean to you here, Scorpio. All right? I feel like you're this masculine here. And I feel like this feminine is the person that you're dealing with here. So the King of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Energy, the Queen of Swords, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini. We also have the Page of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. And the Ace of Pentacles here. And we have the Five of Pentacles here. It does seem like someone here is not really ready to emotionally invest in the relationship and a connection here. And I feel like someone here is feeling very abandoned or someone here is feeling very alone here. Okay? It could be you feeling this way here, Scorpio. Whoever this is, I feel like this person's like giving you the bare minimum here. You know, typically when I see a page, you know, a page doesn't really someone is someone is someone that doesn't really have a lot to offer you know they're still growing they're still evolving they're still learning uh, stuff about life you know this person's still on training mode in life here especially when it comes to love the nine of swords and the full aries energy here the king of wands and also the ten of cups here yeah so i feel like you're ready to take a huge leap of faith here with somebody here but I feel like the person that you're dealing with here is not ready for that. Yeah, the Queen of Swords and the Eight of Pentacles here. Yeah, whoever this person is, this person is very distracted here. This person is not giving you the attention that you're looking for. The Page of Cups and the Queen of Pentacles here. This person could be focusing on their work here, focusing on their Pentacles here, Scorpio. It seems like this person is not showing any sort of interest here. Ace of Pentacles and the Tower, Aries Scorpio energy. The Five of Pentacles and the Ten of Wands here. This situation is starting to become a burden here for you, Scorpio. And I feel like you guys are definitely, you know, in this energy of like, you know what? Maybe it's time to let this go. Maybe it's time to let this go here. I feel like the universe is stepping in with the tower moment to sort of like wake you up here. That nothing is going to come of this situation. What else do we have here for Scorpio? The person that Scorpio is dealing with here, what is this person's true feelings and intentions towards Scorpio? Nine of Cups and the Death card here. Scorpio energy. You know, I feel like the deep down inside, this person cares about you a lot. But, you know, I, I'm not really quite sure what the problem is. Let's see. It seems like this person just doesn't really have a lot to give. Interesting. With the Nine of Cups here, sometimes that, that could be a bit of a selfish energy where this person's looking after their own cups here. It seems like whoever this is, it seems like this is an individual that's not really quite ready for a relationship. 
they keep distancing themselves from you. They're giving you the bare minimum here. This person's giving you some sexy time, but not a whole lot of love here. You know, I do feel like this person reaches out to you when it's only convenient for them for sexy time. Okay, I feel like this person's not really gonna let you go that easily here because I feel like this person uses you for their own purpose here, their selfish purpose here. With a hangman here and a death card, with a hermit, and we have the emperor here, Aries energy. You know, one of the things I'm getting here is that, you know, Scorpio, this person's giving you this energy. I feel like you're gonna give this person back that energy here too. And I feel like once you start ignoring this person, this person will start chasing you here. So I feel like it's a bit of a cat and mouse game that you're playing here with this individual. But it's also stressing you out here with the Emperor Aries Energy, the Queen of Wands, Aries Seal Shash, the Page of Wands here, and the Sun of Cups, and the Knight of Swords here, and the Star Card here. You know, I feel like all you have to do is basically pull your energies back and not try so hard, and I feel like this person will come chasing after you here. Okay, the person will come chasing after you. What else do we have for, for Scorpio? What else does Scorpio need to know, look out for, work on for the uh, rest of their September 2024 Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for Scorpio? Oh, hold on. I'm going to try that again, you guys. Did I miss anything? Okay. We have the Four of Pentacles. All right. And also the Six of Wands, okay. Six of Wands and Temperance, Sagittarius Energy. And also the Eight of Swords here. Eight of Swords and the King of Cups, Cancer Scorpio Pisces, and also the Devil here. Wow. It seems like when you turn your back on this individual here to focus on yourself here and not worry about this individual anymore, I do feel like this person is going to become very obsessed with you and chasing you here. All right? Temperance. Eight of Cups. Not the Eight of Cups. Eight of Swords. King of, King of Cups. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, and the Devil. Capricorn Energy. Temperance, Sagittarius Energy here. What else do we have for, for Scorpio? Four of Pentacles. And we have Justice, Libra Energy, the Six of Wands, and also with the Queen of Cups. Yeah, this person's going to come chasing here. Once you pull your energies back, this person's going to come running, chasing after you here. Seems like this person's definitely learning their lessons, you know, to not play games, to be direct, honest, and transparent here. Okay, what else do we have here for Scorpio Temperance? And the Two of Swords, the Eight of Swords, and the Knight of Pentacles, the King of Cups. And we have the Wheel of Fortune, the Devil, and the Ten of Swords here. Seems like you guys are turning the tables on this individual here. Yeah, it seems like you guys are turning the table on this individual here. And I feel like this is an individual here that is feeling hurt and also betrayed here. But also, this is like a thing that they caused here too. So, yeah, Two of Swords, the Knight of Pentacles, the Wheel of Fortune, and the Ten of Swords. So this person's ready to commit here. This person's opening up their emotions here towards you. And you're turning your back on this individual here. Okay? So, Scorpio. I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Like this video, share this video, subscribe. Hit the notification bell, and I'll speak to you guys in the next one. Thanks, guys. Bye.